In this video, I am going to explain you deterministic trend versus stochastic trend and which is more volatile and why. Take a look at the deterministic trend equation. It is given by yt equal to beta 1 plus beta 2 into t and error 1 error term. So here, tth term has t value of beta 2, 1 value of beta 1 and 1 value of error term. Whereas in case of random walk, with drift you give the equation like yt equal to yt minus 1 plus delta term plus error term but as you know yt minus 1 was also linked with yt minus 2 with similar thing effectively it reduces to yt equal to y0 plus t times the delta term and t times the error term if you do not understand this very well you should take a look at the stochastic trained video kept in this particular channel that particular channel is named as random walk with a random walk model with drift so essentially here yt has one y0 term t delta term and t error term the t error term you know this has one error term this has t error term makes it very much you know very volatile so stochastic trend is more volatile because it's another term has n error terms whereas deterministic tra trend has only one error term for the nth value. So if you take a look at graphically that how does it look like you know the same thing you know I have put one equation you can take a look here it's this fixed value plus error term plus this drift into this is beta 2 into t component you know everywhere if you take a look this is like this into this is very much like the beta 2 into t component you know so the blue line represents the deterministic trend and here the equation in this equation the last term depends on the uh, the current term depends on the last term plus the drift so what you need to understand the deterministic trend is much more you know just varying around a trend you know just going up or down but just around a trend if you fit a trend line you know this you can see very well if you put a trend line you know say put linear you know you can see just it has gone up gone down but it's very much hovering around a particular trend whereas random walk with drift which is stochastic trend you know thou has a trend but it's too very much too volatile however when the drift component is too big you know probably the beta uh, you know drift component is much more much bigger than the error term the error term is in this case we had taken uh, which had mean zero and some variance then this also becomes very much like deterministic trend you just take a look you know if i put 10 here you know these two terms you know starts behaving very much similar even in that case the red line which is the random walk with drift you know stochastic trend is more volatile but when you know um, the drift is comparable to the value of the error term you know it is much more the, the stochastic trend is much more volatile so now coming back to this you understood that you know stochastic trend is more volatile than the deterministic trend and and very much the nature is that you know because stochastic trend has the tth term has t error terms Whereas, in case of deterministic, it has only one error term. Thank you for your time.